I had always been very intrigued by Feng Shui. I um, had bought books, but applying it to my own house, I found it very complicated. It was like, get a compass, try and do this, try and do that. And when I found out that Patricia did Feng Shui, I was very excited and I thought, you know what, I want to give it a go. We had just moved into a new apartment and um, I just had a feeling like this might be very good for me. So I had a discovery call with Patricia and by the end of the discovery call, I was chomping at the bit. She was literally telling me things like Steven Spielberg uses this and all these celebrities. And I was like, if it's good enough for Steven, I want it too. So that was really good. Um, anyway, so she made the process very easy because I don't like getting overwhelmed with mathematics and calculations. She broke it down very, very easily and told me exactly what to do. And she was there every step of the way. And then I gave her my information and then I was waiting and I was so excited. And then we had this, another call. And in the call, she was explaining each section of my house, what it represented and what I needed to do to feng shui. And it was really simple and it did not require moving around any furniture, which I was really freaking out about. It just almost required putting down certain simple everyday things that were easily found. And then the best thing for me was that Patricia did this meditation. And in the meditation, she linked me to the house. Now, no word of a lie, that night, the house started speaking to me. I was like, the house is speaking to me. And the house, I can't even remember what it said, but it was very profound. And since that day, I almost feel like in tune more with the house. And I'd say the most profound thing was when I put down the things for the financial and the wealth area. What happened? I was thinking, I'm going to get richer. Everything crazy started happening when we put that down. So um, bills came out of the blue. All these crazy things started happening. And I was like, this is having the opposite effect, actually. But what it was really doing was helping us to get our finances in order and clean up to make a nice channel for money to flow, which happened after. So the Feng Shui really helped us up level our lives. And I am going to do it again because we just bought a new house. I'm going to have my new house Feng Shui. I wouldn't be without it now. I was feeling a little bit um, not so energetic this morning and I remember Patricia saying just check your health corner make sure it looks nice put some fresh flowers there so I did that and actually I'm feeling great now so yeah feng shui if you haven't worked with Patricia and you're interested in feng shui you should do her course buy her book talk to her she's the lady um get her while you can I don't think she'll be available I literally would just say all areas improved um, and it's a very gradual thing. So it's not like some things were instant, like when I did my fame corner and um, career corner, started getting more jobs, booking jobs. I think actually one was like the same week, like I started booking jobs, I remember, and some were more gradual. But talking to you now and then looking back, I think, yeah, actually, yeah, things did improve because we're very different. When we moved in here to where we now, things are very, very different. Yeah, so it happens gradually, but yeah, it's good. And the everyone, and no one's been in this house and gone. Everyone goes, it feels so good in here. We have to go, you can go home now, like push them out. It's all about harmony. Um, it's all about creating balance and harmony in your private space. Because if you feel at home in your home and you feel calm, you're open for receiving all amazing things coming to you. So that's all it is. It's just creating an energetic balance in your home. And the 
the things that the what are they called? Not the procedures. You call them remedies. 